I had a well pipe, uh, well point uh, that broke off uh, in my uh, well casing. This is my little uh, emergency water supply. Uh, it's uh, 33 feet deep. The casing drops down to about 20 feet. But anyway, the well point broke off uh, a few months ago, and today I decided to come out here and see if I could remove it. So I googled uh, retrieval tools, and everything I saw on the internet didn't even have a price listed for it. So I knew it was going to cost some money, so I decided to just make one. And the one I made uh, worked pretty good. There it is. Brings it right out. The uh, retrieval line is this one. You pull on the drop line to, to unlatch it. it comes right out. Uh, what I did was I I needed something that would behave like a, a teeth or a tooth in, inside the pipe and lock on. So what I did was I t took this uh, small piece of metal which is one inch wide and uh, two and an eighth inch long. You have to make it a little bit longer than the internal diameter of the pipe you want to retrieve. So this was a two inch well point. So I made this two and one eighth inch long. Drill a hole in the center of it. This hole is uh, three eighths. And uh, at the very top, drill a small uh, drop line hole. And over here on the corner that that does all the work. This corner digs into the side of the pipe. This one digs onto the other side and pushes this one into the pipe to lock it in place. So this little hole is like one eighth inch and it's one quarter up and one eighth from the side over here. And this one is one eighth down and centered. Nice piece of stainless. This piece over here is an inch wide, 10 inches long and there's a 3 8 inch hole at the very top of it. This is what gives me the weight necessary to keep the uh, two lines nice and taut while I'm dropping it down in the water. And once you get down there, you have to, you can feel it bumping this pipe. You have to work with it until it enters that pipe. Once you think you're inside the pipe, you just jerk on the tag a little bit, I mean on the retrieval line a little bit like this, and it catches and you can feel the the resistance and it'll hold it in place it worked like a champ and it didn't cost me anything I just but time about a half an hour to make it out of scrap metal and uh, it could work just as easy on metal uh, or PVC